Hello, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing. This unboxing is for from Cool Deals. They did send me these items for review, so thank you to Cool Deals. So I got three more customs, yes. I think I'm gonna run out of things to make customs of, so I might just have to go through their website the next time. But uh, they did send me this lovely pink pen. This is actually a nice way to, you know, dress up your pink pen. Just put a flower. I could get like one of those, you could get some flowers from the Dollar Tree and just make your pink pen really pretty here. So there, got rose here, this lovely purple rose. All right, so so here's the first one. Okay. So this is a picture I got from Pixabay. Hopefully, I remember to to show um to link the picture. Oh look, I think this is different. They have the drills in the baggies now, which is much better when they were than when they were in the little individual packets, because it's so much faster to kit this up. Or, you know, if you're one of those folks who like to just paint. I don't know if does anyone really like to diamond paint from the baggies? One of those ones who are fine diamond painting from the baggies, it's in the baggies. And so ordinary toolkit, except the plate of wax is a little bit on the bigger side. And Look at those beautiful colors. They're really, these, this is, so here it is. It's this picture of corn. Yes, a corn picture. I really like the, the, the pictures of food. Most of my food pictures are coffee related. So I figured maybe I should have a, non-coffee related picture in my kitchen because <laughs> I think I have one that has coffee and croissants and then I have a picture of coffee and cookies and no it is co coffee and a cupcake and cookies so yeah here is some corn here this looks delicious I just had corn today so <laughs> for lunch so this has 33 colors. It is my favorite legend, the one, two, three. There. I these are all gonna be rounds. I I got rounds thinking because I have a lot of squares, and maybe my mom would want to do one of these. So so I got this is a 45 by 55, so this is so this should be Yep, it's about 50 by 40 there. So the customs, you can choose what size you want, what your picture you want, what size drills you want. I mean, what shape the drills, round or square. I see on their site, they, at least for the round drill and the square drill, they have sizes from 30 by 30 to 60 by 120. But yeah, here's my, I got this picture from Pixabay and I thought, this looks really nice. And this is like totally my color scheme. Look at that. That's, look at these beautiful fall colors. I don't know why, but I really like the diamond painting, the fall colors. So I'm not going to show the drills, but yeah, look at that. This awesome browns, and yellows. Yeah, I think... I'm hoping this will turn out nice and I'll be able to see the individual kernels of the corn. So let's zoom in, zoom in. Well, move my, we're not zooming in. I'm just moving my, my picture up. It looks, it looks pretty clear. I think, I think it looks pretty clear. This is going to have some confetti though, <laughs> so maybe my mom won't want to do this one. So next one, let's do this one. Oh, I was going to say, uh, those ones didn't come with this sticker because the other ones came, um, the previous one came with this sticker here. 
But yeah, you can see my picture is gonna be the kiwi. I think I was hungry when I was choosing pictures. <laughs> Don't choose pictures while hungry. So this is... So this one is a smaller one. Don't choose pictures while hungry. Okay, so this one has a different... I don't think I've got... Is this a Mosfa tray? It doesn't look like a Mosfa tray. It looks about the same size as... Yeah. So it, this one has a slightly different toolkit. It's a white boat with some tweezers. The plate is more... A plate of wax is more square here. And... Oh, these come in the baggies too. I like it. Not the little individual packets. And this one actually has a inventory sheet. Did the other one come with an inventory sheet? No inventory sheet. Okay. I'm going to have to write the number of this one. There's, I guess, this one is number two. So that I know if this one is number one. But I have the inventory sheet in there. So... Let's see how the kiwi... I, I, I got this in a small size because I figure it was a zoomed in picture and you don't always have to go big. So, so there, it's this kiwi. So yeah, it is smaller. It's a kiwi. And this one I actually got in rhinestones. So let's see, this is a 33 and a half by 24. So the crystal rhinestones are a little bit more um, expensive than the regular drills and they have a much fewer, fewer size options. So but it looks like it's oh, so there's 30 colors in this okay 30 colors <laughs> there's 30 colors in it and it's still my favorite legend one two three it does look like they use the dmc code even though these are rhinestone drills and the drill field if it'll focus i think looks pretty good here i think it looks pretty good I don't know, are A and K going to mess with me? No, they look different enough. The K and the R, I think they look different enough. But yeah, Kiwi. I figure maybe this picture here will turn out nice as rhinestones. So I thought, see when you're choosing a diamond painting for rhinestones, you kind of have to be like, is that going to look okay as rhinestones? We will see. So... So yeah, this one does have the inventory sheet. I do like inventory sheets because then I just cut this out to make my my labels, especially since there's only one legend on this one, there's only one legend on the other one. So so yeah. Are the drills in order? I'm just wondering. That's 29, that's 28, where's 30? There's 19, 18. So it's not it's not in order order. I'm wondering if they forgot to give me number 30 but I won't know because it looks like it's in order but I don't see number 30 no it's not in order here's like number 10 and then here's 17 so nope it's not in order so yeah these are crystal rhinestone 17 must be black it's 939 yeah so nope not in order here's some green here yeah I just thought the I thought the kiwi would look nice. <laughs> oh, here's number 30. So, purple. So, so yeah, color palette here. Not as obvious, because I, I, there's a lot of, you can see the silver backing, so. So yeah. Oop. So there's this one, and then my third one is actually 
a picture of my sister's dog that I edited to give a background because the background used to be just white. I was like, okay, let's just try a hand at editing the pictures. <laughs> because, yeah, no. Before this, I have never really ad edited any pictures. So, ordinary toolkit. These are also in the baggies, I like it. And yes, look, look at my fall theme pictures. Man, fall, fall theme pictures. Like, this one has some more vibrant colors here. So let me move you up a little because you I think it's gonna need a little bit higher here. So because the picture is up and down. So here it is. It's my sister's corgi. She my sister actually has two corgis. This is the older one. And this picture was taken while she was at work. So it's my sister's corgi, and then the original background was white. Or this this kind of like, you know wall white <laughs> office building white i don't know so so yeah here this is ha this doesn't have the inventory sheet but here's like the original image here so it's my sister's corgi with a scarf, and then I added the orange background. The orange background I got from Pixabay. So, and then I, I found a background killing software. That's what it was. A background killing software that took out the background. I don't know, a background removing um, website that removes the background, and then you're able to add a background. So that's what I did. So... Yeah, my sister's Cardi. Isn't cute? Isn't he cute? So, it's a 40 by 49 and a half. So, so yeah, no, this one is from a photo. So, I'm, uh, well, I think these other two are from photos too. I'm always, I'm always hesitant to do diamond painting sometimes from, from photos and this is I also don't diamond paint people so I don't know I've I haven't seen a diamond painted like a diamond painting of people that ends up looking nice I don't know I always feel like the colors are a little bit off so here is is it has 33 colors still my favorite legend here look at these awesome oranges I'm hoping it'll be awesome oranges so there is the close up here It's also a round. Like I said, I, I decided to go for the rounds on the off chance that maybe my mom wants to, to diamond paint any of them because my mom doesn't do the rounds. Only but look at, look at these awesome oranges here. And then some more neutral colors. And then those are probably the, the couch colors or I don't know, what's some sort of, you know, one of those like cushiony things that have no back. All right, so that's the third one there. So let me move you up so you can see everything unboxed here. So some corn, kiwi, and my sister's doggy, my sister's corgi there. So yes, I'm probably most likely going to do the kiwi. I feel like I can actually finish it in time for the the for this unboxing video, but I would pro I'm probably going to kit them all up because I like all of the pictures and fall is coming. You know, fall is coming, which is time I diamond paint. I diamond paint a lot of fall pictures. I just don't find as many nice fall pictures and diamond paintings as I do as winter pictures, but I really like the fall pictures. So, and I don't think this, yeah, no, this is more summer, but it looks fall color-y. So that's all for now, so I'll see you a little later. So I'm back and I finished the kiwi here. So this is a picture I got from Pixabay and I got it done as a custom from Deals as a 24 
I, I asked for the 30 by 40 size and it's that's canvas size. So the actual image is 24 by 33.5. It's a full drill with poured glue. There were 30 colors and these were all crystal rhinestones. So I thought the rendering was good. The symbols, I thought some were, they were good, except a couple were a little too light. And that's mainly the ones with the white color symbols the white color symbols sometimes depending on how light the background is it was a tiny bit difficult to, to read the stick was fine the canvas was fine the drills were fine there was so gapping actually was actually very minimal but it was causing some popping so i i think the main one was the black causing some popping but then there were other sections where i was like okay there is some popping but I've gone over this with a uh, rolling pin and they're mostly in. They're mostly in. So this took me eight hours and two minutes to complete over three days. So here it is. I think overall it turned out, it turned out fine. Like it does look like the Kiwi here. I do wish this was a more... No, you see, in person, it's a really nice green. Like, on camera, it's not as vibrant green. That's what I find with these crystal rhinestones. It looks much better in person. So, I kind of only, my main thing is I kind of wish this green and this, I guess, inside of the kiwi here was, like, this was maybe a brighter green so that it could offset from that a little bit more. But I think overall, I think it turned out pretty good. I think for, for the size, it's not that big of a diamond painting. And, and probably, you know, rhinestones only have so many colors. Although this thing had 30 colors. So yeah, I think, I think overall it turned out really nice here. You could even see this bubble here. Bubble. Yeah, they, you can see the bubbles. You can't really see the bubbles inside the kiwi, but it's a smaller size. Maybe if it had been bigger, you could in person you could see there's a kind of like circles here, so you, you could kind of see it. But yeah, it looks like it looks like a kiwi. It just the color is just a, like I kind of wish this was just a little bit more vibrant green, just just to make it pop more. All right, so. That's the finish I have from Koo Deals. I have the my sister's corgi picture kitted up, but it's not done. It's not started yet. Um, but I'll, I'll get to it at some point. And at some point, and yes. Yeah, so and then the corn, I have it on my on my wall, my canvas hanging roll thing, and may, maybe it'll pop up in one of those me randomly choosing it on a wheel thing but yeah so thank you very much to Koo Deals for sending this item for review and the other two items and thank you for watching and happy diamond painting bye